Hey, what's going on guys? Travi here from Mira FX and we don't have Mr. Zebo in this tutorial as he's on a vacation. But in this video, I'll be telling you the importance of masking and uh, how it can enhance your uh, video editing flow. So without any delay, let's get started. Alright, so I have a video here. Let me drag this to the right side panel so that a sequence is created. In this video, I have a lady here who is walking onto the camera. So, uh, in order to enhance the quality of the face or the exposure or lighting on the face, I'll create a mask around the face of this subject here. In order to do that, I'll hold Alt on my keyboard and drag this to the top just so that it gets duplicated. And I'll select the topmost video and I'll click on this mask here. Let me just, um, just hide this bottom video for a while and uh, I'll just zoom uh, here. So I'm at the first frame and I'll adjust the size of the mask like this just so that it covers the face of our subject and now what we are going to do is simply drag the face of this character here and I'll just drag this and uh, Adobe Premiere Pro will start tracking the videos such that it it tracks only the face here it usually takes some time. Let me fast forward this video. So once the tracking is done, you can notice that Adobe Premiere Pro has tracked the character's face pretty well and it has come up quite perfectly. So um, if I uncheck this, you can see that the background is now enabled and uh, I'll select the topmost video and from the color palette here or color panel here what I'll do is I'll go to the curves and I'll increase the this value here in such a way that the color of the, the lighting in the face is increased I'll increase the feather so that it comes up quite quite well instead of looking odd and now if I start playing the video you can see that the that the lighting of the face has improved a lot and you can notice the difference if I uncheck this you can see the actual difference between the lighting in the video so this is this effect is quite useful in uh, modeling videos in order to enhance the lighting of the character's face so this is how you generate this masking effect on a video and Adobe Premiere Pro is all about creativity so uh, you can use it in the way you know the way your client uh, demands I hope you like this video and if that's the case give us a thumbs up and uh, if you're looking for more visual effects and tutorials consider subscribing to my channel and if you'd like to talk with me regarding visual effects and video editing, you can always connect with me on Instagram at VFXGuyRavi. See you guys next time with another tutorial.